All right, y'all, so much to talk about when it comes to dandelion. This stuff grows right outside of your house. You can find this literally outside in your backyard, your front, your neighbor's house. I just wanna go over all the benefits this one herb has that grows literally outside of your house. Most children relish the opportunity to blow a puff of dandelion seeds into the wind. This wonderful plant is commonly regarded as a weed and can be found growing in sidewalk cracks and across unattended, untended roadsides and lawns. They are some look alike flowers, so be sure of your identification before harvesting the plant is in the Anster and Daisy family. Dandelion is a perennial herbaceous plant native to North America. It grows from a tap root that reaches deep into the soil. The plant grows up to a foot in height and flowers from April to June. It produces a yellow flower head consisting of florets. Le leaves grow from the base of the plant and then elongated shape with highly jagged edges. The edges are said to resemble a lion's tooth given the plant its name. <laughs> edible use. The entire plant is edible and nutritious. The young leaves are best for greens since the leaves grow more better with age. Young leaves can be cooked or eaten raw. Dandelion root is sometimes dried and roasted for use as a coffee substitute. The root can also be cooked and eaten. They are better with a taste similar to a turnip. Dandelion flowers make a nice salad garnish or can be battered and fried. Unopened flower buds are prepared into pickles similar to capers. Flowers can also be boiled and served with butter. Dandelion leaves and roots make a pleasant but bitter tea. Flowers are fermented to make dandelion wine. Leaves and roots are used to flavor herbal beers and soft drinks. Medicinal use. The entire dandelion plant is used medicinally. The better roots are good for gastrointestinal and liver problems. While the leaves have a powerful diuretic effect, the plant makes a great general tonic and benefits the entire body. It is high in vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. Digestive problem, liver, and gallbladder function. Dandelion root is used to aid digestion and benefit the kidneys, gallbladder, and liver. It stimulates bowel production, helping with the digestion of fats and toxins, removal, use it to treat jaundice and raise energy levels after infection. It removes toxins from the body and restores the electrolyte balance, which improves liver health and function. <laughs> Get this book, y'all. This book is very, very informative. Liver protection and healing. Vitamins and antioxidants and dandelion protects the liver and keep it healthy. Helps protect the liver from toxins and treat liver hemorrhoids. Dandelion tea is used to treat non-alcoholic fatty liver issues. My liver tongue blend dandelion root milk thistles see extract reverse a patient's liver disease to the point that she no longer needs a liver transplant this one is also good for cirrhosis and hepatitis <laughs> diuretic and detoxifying the body dandelion leaves are a powerful diuretic and blood purifier they stimulate the liver and gallbladder while eliminating toxins through the production of excretion of urine they also help flush the kidneys. Even though dandelions are diuretic, it helps replace lost potassium and other minerals that are lost when water and salts are spelled. Skin, skin wound, corns, and warts. Fresh dandelion juice applied to the skin helps wound heal, fights the bacteria and fungi, fungi that would otherwise cause infection. Dandelion sap, sometimes called dandelion milk, is useful to treat itches, ringworms, eczema, warts, and corns. Apply dandelion sap directly to the affected skin. Dandelion tea can be used as a 
Wash on the skin to help healing. Dandelion sap is also useful in treating acne. It inhibits the formation of acne blemishes and reduces scars. Some people are allergic to dandelion sap, so watch for signs of dermatitis on first use. Osteopiopus and bone health. The calcium and vitamin K found in dandelion can protect bones from osteoporosis and arthritis. It helps stabilize bone density and strengthen the bone. Controls blood sugar. Dandelion has several effects that are beneficial to diabetic dandelion juice, stimulates the production of insulin and in the pancreas, which helps regulate blood sugar levels and prevent dang and prevent dangerous blood sugar swings. The plant is a natural diuretic which helps remove excess sugars from the body. It also helps control lipid levels. Urinary tract disorders. The diuretic nature of dandelion helps eliminate toxins from the kidney. Urinary tract, the herb also acts as a disinfectant inhibiting bacterial growth in the urinary system. Prevents and treats cancer. Dandelion extracts are high in antioxidants, which reduce free radicals in the body and the risk of cancer. Its role removing toxins from the body also helpful. Researchers have shown that dandelion root, coupled with burdock root, have potential in treating cancer. Prevents iron deficiency, anemia. Dandelion have high levels of iron, vitamins, and other minerals. Iron is an important part of the hemoglobin in blood and essential for healthy red blood cells formation using dandelion and eating the green helps keep iron levels high. Treating hypertension. As a diuretic, dandelion juice helps eliminate excess sodium from the body and bring down blood pressure. It also helps reduce cholesterol ratios and raises the good HDL levels. Boost the immune system. Dandelion boosts the immune system and helps fight off microbial and fungal agents, mastitis and lactation. Dandelion has traditionally been used to enhance milk production and for treatment of mastitis. Check in with your doctor for this use. Fights inflammation and arthritis. Dandelion contains antioxidants, phytonutrients, and essential fatty acids that re reduce inflammation in the body. This release swelling and related pain in the body. Inflammation is the root cause of many diseases, such as arthritis, terrestrial found, and dandelion roots has shown great promises for osteoarthritis. Harvesting. If you want to harvest it, here are some things you can do. Let y'all see this. They got a recipe for it if you want to make the tea. And that's just one herb in this book, people. Only one herb. Give you this whole description of benefits of dandelion and what this do. So be sure to get this book. Very informative, very powerful. The link is in my video. Make sure you purchase the book. Catch y'all next time. Peace.